Hey there, in this video I want to show you um, how you can um, activate the Tron mode in the SteamVR settings by changing the config file. As you can see, the um, settings still only have um, enable camera and allow camera and dashboard, and this won't help you with the um, so-called Tron mode. Um, but if you go into the configuration file, which is under program files, um, Steam config, SteamVR settings, and you can see camera only has enable camera and camera and dashboard, but here I got a little cheat. Um, and we'll simply copy that over um, to make things easy and quick. So you see um, you can define the color and the alpha channel. And I have activated it for the collision bounds and for the room view. And let me save that, close SteamVR. We open SteamVR. By the way, I'm using the microphone at the HTC Vive, uh, which is built into the headset, which I have on my head, which you'll probably see in a moment. And, and I'm going to show you here. That's the mirror display. And let's go in there. And you can see already, since I'm outside of the bound, this already activates. But I can also activate that via the Steam Bash dashboard with the um, room view. There you go. Now I can look around. And this is actually my room. And as you can see here, um, there I've got my computer. And there's one base station, there's the other. And I can actually still get a little bit of tracking here. But um, when I go like here, then I. I tend to lose tracking because it's actually, yeah, not really what um, the Lighthouse system is designed for. Um, one thing I want to show you here, which I think is quite nice, is that I can very easily uh, change the colors. Uh, let me do some fairly intense green um, for the fun of it. And I'm just going to copy that over. Oops. And restart Steam VR once again. Display mirror. And the room view. There you go. Now we got that fairly intense green. Let me just try something. Um, so I could use my keyboard here, um, this would work, um, but it's, well actually I could probably even kind of, well I can't read anything, sorry about that. <laughs> um, so let me just try something, what happens if I take this over? Restart Steam VR. <laughs> and okay, so I'm going back in. And as you can see, when I'm inside my play area, uh, I don't see it, but it shows up when I go to any of the, of the corners. I can walk around. There you go, there it is, and let's see how that works when playing a game. You go into Steam, into the library, here's Holodance, play in VR, takes a little to load up. There it is, so here I'm inside my game. So what happens if I go to the bounce? There you see, here's my room. And it's um, fairly, fairly low alpha, but when I double tap, I can really see the room here. So yeah, that's it. This is a little palm tree here inside my room. It's kind of like mixed reality, but um, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed that. And um, yeah, that's fun to play with.